A World War II veteran's Goodner home has been ransacked by thieves. The brazen robbers tore apart the grandmother of Eight's house not once but twice in the same day, stealing wartime medals and precious family heirlooms. Christine Brose calls herself a tough old bird. The 89-year-old has lived alone for more than a decade in the Goodner farmhouse she built with her husband 50 years ago. It was her sanctuary until thieves raided it twice in the one day. That night they came and smashed everything, windows, doors, and took what they hadn't taken before. She worked as a code breaker in World War II. They stole her commendation from the British Prime Minister and two medals. There wouldn't be many of them knocking around in Australia, I don't think. Her son Tony found the mess while Christine was away. What she told him would be her last ever reunion of her wartime colleagues. It rips our heart out when we hear things like war medals taken, doesn't it? Thank you. They took hundreds of items, enough to fill a small truck. Not only valuables like antiques acquired by her diplomat father, but food from the fridge, tea bags, and even dog food. I used to come and ask her for food and have given them food. During the floods, Christine opened her house to people who had nowhere to go, gave away clothes and cash. She runs around with St. Vinnie's, you know, she can hardly walk at times, but yet she'll be out on a Tuesday or a Thursday morning just giving out vouchers and, you know, to people that need it. Live now to Darren Curtis at Goodner Police Station. And, Darren, there's been a breakthrough in the investigation. Yes, Melissa, a relative spotted some of Christine's things at a car boot sale. A 45-year-old man has now been charged with being in possession of stolen goods and will face Ipswich Court next week. Now, the medals and the antiques are still missing, and the family say there are hundreds of them still out there. Melissa? All right, Darren, thanks for the update.